Hey guys, so I know um, I look kind of gross. I just woke up. Well, I didn't just wake up. I woke up like around 11. But I wanted to get this off my chest before, you know. I went further in my day because I got up this morning and, of course, I put up a tweet. Um, I don't know. Oh, my brother's leaving for school, so I'm, I'm like, yeah, I'm staying home another year. Um, but I wanted to put this up because I get on Twitter a lot and one of my friends actually hit me up this morning and she's like, oh my gosh, she's like, did you see the photo on Facebook? And I'm like, no. And she's like, well, you have to get on Facebook. Me and you, I haven't got on Facebook in I don't know how many months. I think since my mother's birthday in June. This is August. The end of August. So, yeah, so I'm like, I'm like, okay. So I get up this morning. I look on Facebook. And before I could go any further into my beautiful, beautiful, to find this funny photo that my friend, just, she finds it so hilarious. All I see is random girls' asses on my fucking news feed. Why? I don't know who half you people are on my Facebook. I'm going to let you know. I probably added most of my school class. Um, when I first got Facebook, but then after that, I just got people added me, and I didn't know who anybody was, and I really didn't care at that time. I was just kind of like, add. I didn't feel like going through it and find out who's who. Because really, my life's not that interesting every single day. Some days it is, some days it's fine. So, and then of course, you know, there's a comment, and what I found out is, don't post your ass on Facebook if you do not want people to make a comment about it. The thing is, People are going to say, you have a little ass, you have a lopsided ass. They're going to talk about you just to get a reaction out of you. And the thing is, you give them the reaction. I have no idea what the purpose is of even putting your ass up on a social network. Like, what joy do you get out of it? You get people talking about your ass. Woo! My thing is, you're fine with putting your ass up there and getting good comments, but as soon as one person has a negative comment... You get mad. So my thing is, really, you get mad. I have a ring on. I'm like, I have some on my finger. Let's put a ring. See what I'm gonna wear today. See what goes with my outfit. But um, I'm like, really, like, you're okay saying thank you every time some guy says I want to ride it, and you don't even know him because he's from somewhere else in the country. had to recruit. This is friendly. But my thing is, like, really, I just, I don't understand why I have to be subjected to looking at your ass. Yes, I did go and delete them. That was a simple. But my thing is, I just want to let every girl out there, if you want somebody to see your ass, walk down the goddamn street on a Saturday on your way to the nightclub. Guess what? You'll get just as many comments as putting it up on a social network. Then, your ass doesn't get put around the world. Because once it's up on the internet, it stays there for eternity. Because somebody's going to copy and paste it and post it later in their life. That's how most people have these conflicts in court about shit that goes up on the internet. So, my thing is, people like me do not want to see your ass. If you add me as a friend and I see a picture of your ass on my newsfeed, I do delete you. I, I really don't want to see your underwear, you know. If I want to see underwear, I'd walk in Victoria's Secret. I'm so mean right now. But it's early in the morning. I'm kind of crabby in the morning, as you notice. Things like that irritate me, because I'm supposed to go and look at this funny photo to start off my beautiful day, um, my gorgeous Saturday, because my mom didn't wake me up at the crack of dawn. So I was kind of excited. So I was like, hey, you know. Usually my mom's like up at 7 o'clock. She's like, come on, let's clean the house. Uh, yeah, I know. We can do it at like 12 o'clock. <laughs> when normal people are up. Um... That irritated the shit out of me. I was just like, I have to say something about this. This is going to bug me eternally. But, yeah. Um, if anybody has not seen the movie Sparkle, go see it. It's, oh my god. It made me cry just because, like, the main character, Whitney Houston, she's gone. Like, in this video, you can, obviously, video. In this movie, you can see her, like, you can hear her talking, you can, and if you, if you are a fan of her, like I am, that's something that speaks to you, because it's like, 
this is the last thing she did before she left us. Like, she just, you know, we was waiting for another album, you know, we was waiting for more concerts, and then she just up and she went to Dip Center, like, she just wanted to leave us. I'm like, what? No! We didn't even know. We was waiting, patiently. <laughs> um, because I, I was surely, I was one of those people who, like, if she has a next album come out, I'm in the stores grabbing it, you know, when this come out on DVD, I'm, I'm hitting the store and getting it, um, believe me, like, I'm like, oh my god, you know, I was still, I was, like, kind of like a toddler when she was up in the 90s, I was little, you know, now I'm like, okay, now I can go to a concert by myself when you decide you want to go chill with God, like, really, like, is he? No, I'm not gonna say that because some people that'll be controversial. People like argue over that all the day. When some people know what I mean, but but I really wanna like it, it's crazy to me. I just I don't understand. I really don't. Um, so it's like I don't know. But for just remember the point of this con this point of this video was. If you want comments in your ass, wear a really tight dress and go to the club. Believe me, guys will glue their eyes to your ass all night. And then, guess what? You get the same amount of comments with less of frustration. Your fingers don't get cramped because you can just cuss them out in person. You know, then they know when you're serious and when you're just joking. Till next time, love you guys. See you later.